Hello friends. Welcome back to Fun Info Time. In this video we'll explore the top 5 Indian defense news of the week. 1. DRDO pursues next-gen laser beam riding guidance air defense system, India's Defense Research and Development Organization, DRDO, is making progress in missile technology with its new expression of interest. The DRDO plans to develop a laser beam rider guidance system with an iSafe laser range finder in India. This system will improve missile accuracy and effectiveness by using precise laser guidance. The LBRG system is a new method for guiding missiles. It uses a special laser beam to send crucial information to the missile while it flies, helping it find its position and adjust its path to the target. This system ability to work in challenging battlefield conditions, such as smoke, fog, rain, and dust, unlike semi-active laser guidance systems that may have trouble in bad weather. 2. DRDO Project VEDA Development Trials May Start Soon, India's Dedicated Satellite Defense Launcher Project VEDA, or Vehicle for Defense Application, is a DRDO project to develop a new satellite launch vehicle, SLV, for the Indian Armed Forces trials for which are likely to begin soon. The SLV, codenamed VEDA, will be used to put defense satellites into lower orbit for a variety of purposes, including surveillance, communication, and navigation. The VEDA SLV is a three-stage, solid-propellant rocket that will be capable of lifting a payload of up to 2,000 kg into orbit. It is expected to have a maximum altitude of 200 km. 3. IAF successfully conducts night vision goggles-aided landing in eastern sector. The Indian Air Force IAF, has achieved a significant milestone by successfully landing an aircraft using night vision goggles NVG, for the first time on an advanced landing ground in the eastern sector. The IAF's official account shared this achievement, stating that an IAF C-130J aircraft carried out a successful night vision goggles aided landing at an advanced landing ground in the eastern sector. The successful NVG landing shows that the IAF is continuing to upgrade its equipment and improve its personnel skills. This accomplishment highlights the IAF's dedication to protecting the country's sovereignty and being ready to handle any security threats. 4. Securing the Indian Ocean, IAC-3, India plans to build a third aircraft carrier to strengthen its control over the Indian Ocean, especially in case of conflicts with China and Pakistan. This new carrier will increase India's naval strength and help it prepare for potential conflicts on two fronts, the Indian Ocean is very important for India. It is like a lifeline because a lot of India's trade and energy imports come through it. China's increasing naval presence and an unresolved border dispute with China make India see this area as a strategic threat. Also, the tense relationship with Pakistan means India needs a strong navy in the Arabian Sea, the new aircraft carrier is planned to be built in India. Supporting the country's goal of self-reliance in defense manufacturing. This effort includes not just aircraft carriers, but other naval equipment too. However, there are worries about possible delays in the project, similar to those experienced with India's first home-built carrier. 5. Possible upguards of the India's T-90 Mark III, Heavy Vehicles Factory, HVF, has successfully delivered the first batch of upgraded T-90 Mark III tanks to the Indian Army. These upgrades aim to greatly enhance the capabilities of the current T-90 fleet. While specific details are not disclosed, some important features of the modernization program are known. The Mark III upgrade includes a digital communication system, allowing easy and secure communication between crew members and other battlefield units. For better fire control, it has an LCD monitor for the thermal imaging site and a digital ballistic computer, which makes targeting and weapon control easier. 